G'day everybody, welcome to Heiner Builds Your Ride. We've got a pretty big build this week. It is a man truck, an MAN. Um, we've put seven 120 watt Redux solar panels on the roof and we've got three MPP chargers and a adapter for a, an Anderson plug for a solar blanket. So we'll run you through all that we've installed in this. So as you can see, we've got four 120 watt panels here on the roof, all connected in, uh, two in series, two in parallel, um, connected into a junction box, which is going through the roof, all fully sealed. Uh, the customers said before, a lot of problems with water leakage through the cab. So we made sure a big effort on sealing all of the, with Sicker, uh, Sicker Flex 221, make sure it's all nice, all clean, and there was no chance of any water leaks. Uh, as you can see on the front, just in front of us, we've got three more 120 watt Red Arc solar panels, all connected, um, daisy chained, linked together, and coming through into the cab through this uh, system here. One of the things the customer did mention is the cab tilts on this, so we had to put in a connector so he can quickly disconnect it. Um, and allow enough slack for the actual body roll of the cab to the truck. So we've made it in a way where it will still give you enough movement when he's driving along. In the battery compartment here, we've got four 260 amp full river batteries uh, connected up uh, in a 24 volt system in, uh, linked together where um, we will have 520 amps of um, amp hour battery able to use. We've installed in here a BMV 700 battery monitor so that the customer can monitor how much he's pulling out and putting it in with the solar charging. We've installed the MIDI fuse holder here for his solar regulators that we've installed and everything goes through the cab, um, completely sealed and allowing uh, no, no dust or dirt or moisture getting into the car, uh, into the cab. In here we ha also have An Anderson connector here through its own 50 amp MPPT regulator. So that here is connected up um, with a link to Anderson so that we can have another 600 watts of solar with two, two 300 watt blankets connected up there. So on, on the roof, we've got about 840 uh, watts of solar with an extra 600 uh, with blankets allowed on the ground. So we've definitely beefed it up enough to charge these batteries. All right, and we'll go inside now and show you the uh, where the MPPTs are mounted. Electronic steps and all in this one. So under the seat where we've got the inverter mounted, we've got the MPP, two MPP regulators mounted, a 50 and a 30. The 30 controls the front panels. There's also another MPPT regulator mounted up the top. Um, where that will mount and monitor the rear panels, the four panels on the rear, and the 50 is solely for the blanket system, um, and they're all connected up with uh, correct gauge cable or wired into the battery and all correctly fused. And last thing we've got is the two Victron Energy display screens uh, for the solar regulator, the, the MPT30 for the front panels, and this is the battery manage, uh, the BMV shunt manager, uh, the monitor, display what's coming in and out. Uh, we also have another display just up here for the rear panels as well. Uh, all right, I hope you've enjoyed this build. Uh, remember to like and subscribe, and uh, now this one's ready to drive anywhere.